talking about fame and all of this, and yeah. this is kind of scary to me. You were robbed at knife point. Mm. Th- when did this happen to you, Harry? This was, uh, it was on Valentine's Day, which Where I guess you? is like, you know, that's what you get for being single these days, I guess. <laughs> right. Yeah. Are you, you single right now? I should have had <laughs> other plans. You don't have it. You were single and you were what? Just walking around? I was walking home from, uh, from a friend's house. Crying your eyes out because you had no love Correct. on Valentine's <laughs> yeah. Day. Could I was imagine. walking out. You were love So yeah. I was about five minutes from home. And uh, I'm walking up and I kind of see this group of, this group of guys. They've all got like hoods up and their face is covered and stuff. And I was like, oh, that's a bit weird. Do so they know turned, it's you? No, I had like a, my, a hood up and a big jacket on, a hat on, and everything. Right, it was pretty cold, and um, and I turned my music off because I was listening to some music. So you walk around with headphones on and you're listening to music, which you should yeah. not be doing. You should be aware of your surroundings. Right. But okay, you, well, go ahead. I'm not going right. to bust your so balls. So I turn it that. off. Yeah, and I'm walking up the street, and I keep kind of turning around, and the guys cross the road, and I'm like, oh, that's, that's weird, you know, and uh, and then I'm walking up. And I hear, like, there was, like, gravel on the pavement. So I hear, like, shuffling of feet trying to, like, catch up to me. So I cross the street, and then they cross the street. And I'm like, oh, fuck's sake. This is bad. And then I cross the street again, and then they cross the street again. And I'm like, oh, for fuck's sake, I think I'm about to get robbed. So the guy's like, hey, can we talk to you for a minute? And there's nobody around. So I'm like... Is your heart pounding? Yeah, yeah. a bit. Yeah. Um, so I'm like, Sure. And uh, he's like, do you smoke weed? And I said, no. And he goes, do you want some weed? And I thought, no. And then he was like, what have you got on you? And they all kind of gathered around me. This was a li- something I've been a little bit pissed off about is because uh, I've filed a police report, so then obviously it goes in the press and everything. Right. And they wrote that there was only one guy, so I'd like to clarify there was more than one guy. Right. But uh, <laughs> yeah. in other words, so, for your for your for your for your ego, I'm like, the, the, yeah, I was, could have fought off one guy. Yeah, like right. you know, someone was like, oh, it says there was a guy with a knife. I was like, just it, one. It was a bunch of guys. It was a bunch of guys. It was right. eighty-seven guys. Yeah, you know, um, as soon as Harry Styles files a police report, that's the other horrible thing. That's going to be a public thing, right? Yeah, there's no so, such thing as keeping that private. So he's like, "What have you got on you?" And I'm like, "I don't have anything." You know, they say stop fucking around and that kind of thing. Mm. So I have some cash in my pocket. So I said, I've got some cash. So I pull out some cash. He takes it from me. And then uh, I had like my headphone jack just sticking into my pocket. And he was like, what's that plugged into? I'm like, oh, God's sake. It's my phone. So he's like, pull out your phone. So I pull out my phone. And I'm thinking, okay, this is really annoying. But, you know, I'll wipe it and get a new phone and kind of whatever. Not worth fighting over a phone. Not worth fighting over. And then uh, the guy's like, okay, unlock your phone. And uh, the other one, like, pulls his shirt up and he's got, like, a knife sticking in his in his pants. I was like, shit. And I, I'm kind of thinking, like, do I get... I just said, like, I can't. Like, I'm sorry. I, like, wow. mate, I was like, mate, I, I can't unlock my phone. And then the guy's like, you've got 10 seconds to unlock your phone. He starts counting down. And I'm like, fuck, am I going to unlock my phone? Am I going to give him my phone? What's the deal? So then I try and give him my phone. And he's like, no, I need to unlock it. And I was like, I can't. And then there's a little pond behind them near where I live. And I, I thought about throwing it in the pond to just be like, but they would, neither of us have it, right? Oh. Yeah, but then they would have stabbed you. And, uh, and then I thought I didn't want to piss them off. Right. And the lights changed and there was like two cars coming. And I just like felt an opportunity and I just sprinted, ran. And they didn't chase you? Well, I ran into the road and I tried to stop a car and obviously a madman runs into the road, tries to get in your car, you're not going to let him in. So right. they don't let me in. Uh, try and get in another car, don't let me in. But now I'm slightly away from them because I'm in the street. And I think like I just burned just turned down and ran back towards like the little village area near where i live so i just kind of sprinted but usually when i'm out walking i'm wearing like running stuff right and this was the one night i'm wearing like corduroy flares and shoes yeah great and i was like i'm gonna have to fucking sprint all the way down this hill so uh yeah i just sprinted down down the thing and and i guess because they had some cash and stuff they just ended up turning around 